Greetings! You're watching Septim Sen vs. the World. I'm Septim Sen. This is another anime update. My voice is slowly coming back. My hope is that by this time, by the next week, so I'll have it full. <laughs> but, so I'll be short and sweet. So we have the first Slam Dunk, which Shout Factory is going to be releasing through their G Kids line. Um, so $23.99, which is not terrible for a Shout Factory movie. Especially one that's two hours long. And uh, this one actually... <coughs> I mean, I've read a little bit of Slam Dunk. Uh, it's an entertaining and an old series. Probably one of the older sports uh, anime slash manga. So it's kind of cool to have uh, to have one of these at your... Well, at hand. Um, one of these days I might have to collect some of Slam Dunk. I just haven't really done so i didn't get too far into the manga I, I just read it while i was had a subscription to shonen jump but still fun enough story fun enough characters so you know if you want it go for it so one of the waifus of the week uh that we've had for a while um every so often there's a new waifu that is uh, at the center stage and this is definitely no exception to the rule. Oshi no Ko Season 1 is releasing through Sentai. As always, I don't show... I usually try to show them where they're coming from. <clears throat> if they have a store page, especially here, because it will go on sale eventually, uh, I can guarantee you that I will be... Um, I will be getting it eventually, uh, because I've heard nothing but praise for this show and it could just be because the waifu of the week is just there but i feel that there's usually something more to those <laughs> but you got a starlet who's pregnant and this guy helps her deliver these children in secret but the doctor is killed and his spirit is reincarnated in one of the two children <laughs> so it's interesting i like the plot concept and uh, I do plan on uh, checking this out eventually, once uh, there. Maybe even when I can afford the price, it's one I think I might pay the full retail for. It's just, uh, you know, money. Money. And I've already done a Sentai order not long ago, because I, I had to get that Orisai Yatsura OVA. I know it's not out yet, but I had to have it. Uh, had to have it pre-ordered. I've got everything else converted. I want to convert that <laughs> So this one I've bookmarked. Um, so this is the Swordsmith Village arc from Demon Slayer. I'm kind of holding for now. Again, I don't have the money, so that's the big reason. Two, I try to get the, the regular Funimation slash Crunchyroll release. But we'll see if... Uh, I've heard rumor that this may be the only release of it, which would be a big shame. But I'll give it a few months and see where it is um unless it starts to run low and if it does then maybe i'll have to get it but i like to keep them going i'd rather not get a thing with that big a box i'd rather have a smaller box and i'm hoping with a series like demon slayer that there will be a um a more standard release let me just check a quick check right now it's the only one showing which shows that probably for the next two to three months there's not going to be but there may be a I'm sure there's gonna be a standard release down the line again this series is too popular for them to just say okay limited run that's done <laughs> but uh, we'll see these usually hold for a while they don't go out of print super soon so we'll hope for the best all right, last two are Isekai. I got cheat skill in another world and became unrivaled in the real world. This looks to be an interesting series. I'm not like um, going to get this for fifty-two dollars, but a lot of you love these types of things. I know that there is there are definitely tons of people out here that love Isekai and buy every single one because if there weren't, they wouldn't be the main like. 80% of the anime market right now. So, I know you. I know there's some of y'all out here that want this, so I'll just let you know that it's out there. Um, and another isekai, 
an aristocrat's otherworldly adventure, serving gods who go too far. So the stew dies and is reborn as an aristocrat. Now, I like the plot. Sounds interesting. It's not $52.49 worth the plot for me, but it may be worth that for you. So I want y'all to know about it. And that's everything this week. Like I say, next week, hopefully I'll be a little bit more long-winded and my voice is a little bit better and I'm not like coughing constantly. So with that, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you did, hit that subscribe, hit that like, and please let me know in the comment section below what anime are you picking up this week? Because we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.